Today is going to be a great day. This is your day for something new. This is your day to make it through. This is your day to so come along and see what you can do. You can have it. You can do it. You can make it. Nothing to it. Successful it is yours. Learn to be successful. Hi, it's Stacia from Life Coach to Women and Stacia Pierce TV. I'm super excited about 2013. I'm glad that we are in the brand new year. Now, let me talk to you today about some exciting things that are on the horizon. I know you're feeling like 2013 is the year that you must make some things happen. I know you can feel that there's a, a shift that has taken place and people are really feeling the urgency like something big is on the horizon but I have to do something now or either I'm going to miss out on what I'm supposed to do. And so I'm sure that you're feeling that. I'm sure you're feeling an urgency to finally profit from your purpose, to, to answer your call, to do what you feel like you've been destined to do. And so I want to talk to you about how you can make this year, this 2013, your best year ever. And I know sometimes it's a cliche and we talk about, you know, how to make something our best year ever. And, you know, the beginning of the year, we're all going and getting gym memberships and everybody fills their pantry with healthy food and we clean out the refrigerator. And, you know, and then we have to check back 30 days later to see where we really are. If we really kept up those rituals and those, those resolutions that we have said that we're going to do, that we declared that we're going to make, these changes we said that are going to take place. I believe that 2013 is a very serious year. It's very pivotal. And I believe that it's the year of accountability. It's the year where we get help. Let me explain myself because I want you to understand me naturally and spiritually. And I, I've hit it last year on what the year was going to bring and what was going to happen for us in 2012. I hit it in 2011 and I believe that I'm on for 2013. The year of accountability, the year we get help. You know, I know that if you're going to really make the changes that you see on the horizon, if you're going to achieve those goals and those dreams and those desires that you really want to, then I know that you're going to have to do something real simple, and that is get help. Get help. Let me explain to you how you can get the help you really need. You know, on New Year's night, I opened up my inbox and it was flooded, literally flooded with people saying, you know what? I'm ready. I'm ready to be mentored. I'm ready to have a coach. And how do I get started? And what's it going to cost me? I was surprised because in the years past, I had people say Happy New Year's. I had people inbox me and say, I'm excited or I'm setting my goals. I'm with you for 2013. Never have I seen this flood of people all at once, just proclaiming and saying, you know what, I know that this is a year I need to make some changes and I'm ready to sign up now. So let me tell you why people came to that point. Why did they finally feel like it was time to do something? I know that because as the economy, as our world has transformed and has changed, it's time for you to finally profit from your passion. It's time for you to step up into your rightful place. And I know that you're feeling like there's, there's a season, there's a window, there's a door for me to step into it. And that time and window and opportunity is right now. So let's jump right in here. The first thing you want to do is be humble. Yep, that's right. Be humble. You know, just admit that you need some help. That's where we really start getting the help we need when we're humble enough to say, I need help. You know, sometimes you want to feel like I can take on the world by myself. I can do this by myself. I can make things happen by myself. You really need to just take the plunge and just say, you know what? I need help. So that's it for number one. Just say that out loud with me. Say, I need some help. I need some help. That's like therapy. I need some help. All right. The second thing to do is to be teachable because once you admit, I need some help then you have to put yourself in the position of a student. You know, there's a saying that says that when the student is ready, the teacher will appear. I know that that's true because every single time in my life where I became a student, when I became a mentee, when I said, you know what, 
I need help. You know, I need help to go to the next level. I need help to cross over this finish line. I need help to go up. I need help to come out. Whatever it was that I needed help in, once I admitted it, then I had to make changes within me. I had to become teachable. I had to say, you know what? I don't know it all. And most of the time when we need help, we don't even know what we need to know. Most people are not succeeding in their business and in their life. They're not having the success that they want because it's not that they're not trying, it's that they don't even know what it is that they need to know. And so that's why dreams die between what to do and how to do it. Because you don't even know what you need to know and then you don't know how to do it once you find out what it is you're supposed to do. That sounds like a tongue twister, but you get it, you understand where I'm coming from. Be teachable. You know, find yourself a teacher, a coach, a mentor. Find you somebody who you can say, you know what, I don't know it all. I'm humble enough. I'm standing here before you and I'm telling you that I need the help and I'm ready for you to teach me. That brings me to my third point. Be an investor. That's right. Be an investor. You're going to have to make an investment if you want to have advancement. No investment, no advancement. It's as simple as that. You have to make an investment for where you want to advance to. You have to be willing to pay for your help. You have to be willing to step up and say, I can't get it for free because you know what? Wherever it is you are right now, whatever playing field you're playing on, whatever game that you're playing, however big it is right now in life, you're playing the game that you have made the investment to play. And if it's not big enough for you, that means you're gonna have to make an investment. My life completely shifted and went to a whole new level when I finally said, you know what, I don't know, I need some help. Then I said, you know what, I'm gonna be teachable. But then I went a step further and said, I'm not gonna be too cheap to make an investment in my own self. I'm going to make an investment to get the help that I need. And so that's why my inbox was flooded on New Year's night because people came to the conclusion that I tried it in 2012. I did it my way. I tried to do it and I maybe had tried to even do it without having to make an investment. But now I know that I'm going to have to make an investment for my advancement and I'm ready. You know, let me share this with you. I want to give you a secret. If you want to have big transformation, if you want to have big breaks and big breakthroughs, and you want to have big barriers moved out the way, that's going to take your investment. Yep, it's going to take an investment. You know, I hear stories and I even watch the last few days. I watch stories and biographies about people making it and what it took to really cross over to the other side. And when was it that they really felt like this is it, I'm living my dream and they finally went big. But you know what? There was a common denominator in every single story that every person talks about that they had to finally make some kind of investment, that they had to do what they were unwilling to do before. They had to make an investment of their money, don't, not just everything else, but their money. Then they had to make an investment of their time, their talent, their energy. They had to be willing to do what others weren't willing to do. And so your investment is crucial in 2013 to your advancement. And I don't want you to think you could take one, two, and four and not do this one and you're going to get there. This is one of the big keys that's going to get you on the other side to where you want to go. All right, so that brings me to number four. So now that you're humble and you're saying, I do need some help and I'm not exactly where I want to be. And then you say, you know what? I'm going to be teachable. Somebody else does know more than I do and somebody can actually help me get to where I want to go. There's somebody that really can see a picture was possible for me and they want to help me. And then you have to say after that, that I'm going to be willing to make an investment. And you know what? No matter what it takes, I'm going to stick it out. I'm not going to say I don't have the money. I'm not going to make up excuses for where I am in life. I'm going to find it. I'm going to make the investment. I'm going to go all the way with it this time. I'm not dropping out. I'm not quitting. I'm not going to quit on myself. You know, those who invest in my coaching tell me something all the time. At the end of the year, I always go back and I read through letters and emails and just awesome testimonials because it encourages you to go forward to the next year. And you know what? When I read those letters and testimonials, there was something that so many of my clients said. 
They said that once they made the investment, once they made the decision to pay, to make an investment in themselves and to stick it out, that all of a sudden the floodgates of increase opened for them. That it wasn't until their mind shift changed and they said, you know what, it's going to cost me something, but I'm willing to do it. That at that very moment, they felt like something broke in their financial situation and money began to pour in from all kinds of resources. Plus, they learned the secrets to making money on top of that. So I'm telling you that when you make the investment, it's you take the step first and then the increase comes on the other side of that. Which takes me to number four. Number four is be big. That's right, be big. You know, after you have decided that I'm going to just be humble and then you say, I'm gonna be teachable. And then you say, I'm going to be an investor. I'm going to invest in my increase. Then you have to make up your mind that I'm going to be big, that this is it. This is my time. This is my season to be big. All right, so what do I mean by be big? Believe that you are worthy enough and you are capable of success right now in this moment. That's why I put together the Go Big Coaching Program. I'm so excited to be launching it right now in the beginning of the year because I know how important it is to the rest of your year. I know this program works because one, the accountability factor. You're accountable every single day for your actions. Number two, it works because it's action oriented. It makes you take fast action. It shows you where to take action, what to take action on. And then it really works because of the wealth attraction accelerators. My goodness, it tells you what to do every single day of your life to begin to attract wealth and increase in finances into your life. And then it sets you up. Every lesson sets you up to go bigger and bigger. And so that's why it's so exciting because it's one of those programs that when you get in, it's like you're on a curve, you know, you're starting here and when you end on this super high, but you don't have one of these fictitious highs where, you know, you get this high and then you're like, what do I do next? No, when you get through this Go Big coaching program, a shift has taken place in your life and you finally understand the principles and what it takes to achieve what you want to achieve in your life. One of my coaching clients that took Go Big last year, they had a desire in class one to be on the Dr. Oz show. We achieved that within that year. Another client had desire to do their own clothing line. We achieved that. Another one said that they wanted to have a TV show. Can you believe that? Never did TV before, never been in the media even. And you know what? They have their own national TV show. That's what I'm talking about. This is your year to go big. All right, so this is what we're talking about, 2013. This is your year, but this is your year for accountability and get the help that you need to succeed. I wanna make sure you opted in for the Go Big training, and if you already have, then I wanna make sure that you have already went to the Go Big coaching program page and that you have already decided, you know what, I think I need some help. I think that, you know what, I'm inspired to invest in myself I believe that I'm gonna be teachable enough that I can go big in 2013. If so, meet me on the other side, get into this coaching program, and I can't wait to hear your go big story. All right, that's it. That's what I have to say for 2013. That's what's happening, that's where we're going. We're going big, and you know what? I tell you what, these principles work no matter what, so make sure you apply them today. All right, be inspired to succeed. Sign off from Station Pierce TV. Ladies, Dr. Stacia Pierce is going on tour. That's right, in 2013, she's kicking off her exciting Ultimate Success Tour. And guess where it starts? In Orlando, Florida, January 19th at the Rosen Center Hotel. Then in March, she's headed to the prestigious Wynn Hotel in Las Vegas. In May, she's stopping in Atlanta, Georgia. So you may have seen her on Stacia Pierce TV or even at her women's events, but seeing her live on this Ultimate Success Tour is going to be 10 times better. So reserve your seat at one of our exciting stops and join Dr. Stacia on her Ultimate Success Tour today. Learn to be successful. Learn to be successful. Learn to be successful.